Ah, human. It is wonderful to see you again. Hmm. Ah, yes, I did receive your invitation. The one with the... Yeah, the uh, scented letter. I do have a question. Why orange? Hmm. I suppose you're right. I do prefer more... fruity scents. <laughs> you know me so well. Well, no offense, human, but you're the only one to ever get this close to me. I, Aristotle, am the only griffin that prefers humans over their own kind, I'm assuming. <laughs> hmm, you're gonna make me stand in the doorway, you're gonna let me in. I don't want to be rude, but it is rather chilly out here. Hmm, thank you, human. <laughs> oh dear. Did I get you all flustered? Oh, relax, relax. They're just my feathers. I don't feel any shame if you accidentally brush into them. Would you feel blushed if a random person bumped into you? No, you would not. <laughs> you need to learn to relax around me, human. I may be royalty, but... <laughs> I'm not a jerk. At least I try not to be. I try to be respectful when I can be. Hmm. Oh, it's nothing, human. It's just that you seem really tense. You remember we are friends, after all. <laughs> you don't need to be so uptight around me. That's why I like you. You talk to me casually. Before you found out I was a Roy, you treated me just like any other man. I appreciate that. So come on, cheery up. <laughs> there you go. There's that smile I like so much. Now, human, I, I do have a few questions. Well, maybe more than a few. Uh, the first one is, um, what's a Thanksgiving? Oh, what? What? Uh, Mayflower. Uh, human. The story sounds made up. I mean, okay, okay. Look, I'm not offended about the turkey thing. That's turkey. Even I eat turkey. But why make a whole holiday around it? Is it just for fellowship? Is that the point? Is it family? Um, I guess I'm just confused about the message of the holiday. Uh, Christmas, I kind of get. You know, you're giving gifts and drinking and eating. But I'm not sure I quite understand Thanksgiving. It's the only acceptable time of the year to gorge yourself. So it becomes socially acceptable to eat more than you really should. So it's, uh, what do you call it? Um, it's a holiday of gluttony and greed. No, human, I don't mean to be offensive. I I'm just trying to understand. Please don't, don't take this as me, uh, trying to, um, disrespect your holiday. I just simply wish to understand what you're attempting to tell me. I see. So, hmm. hmm. No, it sounds reasonable-ish. I mean, gorging yourself on food is neither here or there. <laughs> Though I don't think I'll be gorging myself, as you call it. <laughs> well, for one human, um, I'm quite a bit bigger than you, and I doubt you can make enough food to where I would be. Well, I'll be satisfied, but I wouldn't be bursting at the seams. <laughs> I mean, I can basically eat a whole cow and be fine. It would take a lot to get me bursting. But I'll gladly enjoy your food. <laughs> oh. You like my outfit. Uh, thank you. I tried to go more, uh, incognito, but 
my butlers are all like, oh, you need to wear fancier clothing, even going to your friend's house, so I'm sorry if it looks a bit stuffy. I mean, it's not as elegant and royal as I usually wear, but it um still looks quite uh, stuffy. <laughs> Say, dear human, um, I do have another question. So, like, I'm a royal, so I don't really, um, cook, as, as you say. And, um, so it leads me to ask another question. How exactly do you cook a turkey? Do you just roast it over a fire, or... Y you do what? Um, that seems kind of violating. You stuff the turkey. Um, okay then. And then you... Oh my. You paste it. Well, I suppose that makes sense. But what do you serve, um, turkey with? Ham. And stuffing? Yams. Uh, pumpkin pie. I'm afraid I don't know what most of the stuff is. I mean, I know what ham is, but... Well, you know me. I'm more of a carnivore. I can't eat vegetables. It's just... I tend to prefer meat. <laughs> hmm? Uh, oh. Right. Um... Let's see. Uh, there we go. Here you go, human. That's... You didn't want one of my feathers... And what did you mean by... Oh, you just wanted me to get comfortable and sit down and then relax. I see, I see. Sorry, I... This is all very new for me. <laughs> it's funny how our friendship started out, though, don't you think? Well, um... I was down on my luck, and I was pretty heartbroken... My dear Stefana, she stabbed me in the back, literally, and then she got a new mate, and then you came along and cheered me all up. <laughs> what was it that you did? Uh, um, if I remember right, you twirled around in the rain with an umbrella and started acting like one of those old cartoon shows. It cheered me up quite fast. After that, we began talking, and you told me about your life, and I told you about mine. Well, keeping some facts hidden. And our friendship officially began. And then, you know, I invited you to that ball, and then you found out I was, um, royalty. <laughs> and then, um... Well, we, um... Danced. Catching the surprise of you and my parents. Trying to explain to them that we weren't dating, though, was quite the ordeal. <laughs> Although it definitely made many suitors jealous. I wouldn't mind doing that again with you, though. Hmm. Hmm? What is it? We might enjoy something else. Except the turkey? Hmm, what could you be talking about, human? I am so oblivious, I could possibly never know what you mean by that phrasing at all. <laughs> Sorry, dear human, I can't help myself. Your flustered face makes it all the better. Alright, let me ask you one final question, human. Do you want to kiss me? Oh, come on. Answer the question. You've been so good with answering all the others. I'm sure you wouldn't mind putting your lips upon mine. <laughs> uh, have my claws wrap around you. My feathers pushing into you. <laughs> Do you want to date a royalty? <laughs> good answer. 